Welcome to my channel. My name is Shivin. Today we are doing video tutorial number 6. How to do a thermal printer, auto cutter thermal printer in Raindeck POS uh, billing software. The full setup I will uh, show you how to do the setup. So in order to that, just go to our uh, Raindeck POS billing software. And you can see in the sale panel over here in the left side. Here you can see uh, sale. Uh, here you can see in the top bill templates here go to build templates and here in the printer settings right now there is no printer is set out if there is printer is already done you will get a you know link over there even though there is a link just if you are using the software in first time just remove that select that link and delete it then only your computer name will come over here in the top here then only the, uh, the printer call, call will go to the printer yani from the software the call will go to the printer so uh, if any printer is already there just select and delete it so afterwards you need to install the printer driver so in order to the, see if you go here uh, maybe there is a driver or may not be there as a driver if you want to install the printer driver uh, along the printer you will get a CD uh, for the printer there are so many models are there actually uh, auto cut thermal printer each printer you will get CD or you can visit their website also to download the proper driver so uh, for this X printer this is uh, X printer so in, uh, for the X printer uh, driver it is available even in our website you can I will show you in our website raindexstore.com you can go to raindexstore.com and there is a downloads uh, there is so many downloads is there already in the last you can see uh, there is a printer driver 7.77 uh, you can see over here 7.77 ATM uh, this driver you can download 7.77 X printer driver just click it on it is in uh, Google uh, Drive you can just download it I'm just downloading it and uh, it's downloaded in the down you can select it just open it yes again accept the license agreement and next again uh, next again install finish there is a windows uh, which windows you are using windows 10 or windows 7 it will, it will automatically detect my computer is already windows 10 so that's why it is written uh, windows 10 and here usb you have to select because i connected with the usb cable okay so that you will uh, select usb and in the down there is so many options are there uh, there is atmm and atc also is there here atmm and atc if you select atmm the auto cut mechanism will not work if you select atc the auto automatic uh, cutting mechanism will work properly and you must uh, make it as a default printer because the default the software will go uh, call on default printer basically and uh, check usb port here you can see one uh, button is here check usb port just click on that you will see one test print already came over there it's just a test print and uh, after that after that in the uh, exactly right side you will see one uh, button install now just click on that and yes again test print will come over here that's it the installation procedure after that you need to go to control panel control panel and uh, there is uh, hardware and sound and the devices and renders just go there devices and printers in windows 8 uh, maybe uh, devices and printers it will scroll in a certain time just wait for one or two one minute maybe maximum so you will see there is a particular settings you need to do that's the thing i am showing See now all your printers is shown there. If uh, if 
uh, for some uh, you know old generation computer some limitations are there to uh, add number of printers so if such kind of limitations is showing in your pc you can remove your uh, you know unwanted printers installation you just right click and uh, remove devices like that now the new installation the atmm driver is here right now this is one here you can just right click again you make it as a default printer we make it in the installation time but it does not happen now we done it again here so from here also check go to the properties and again make a text print to ensure that everything is perfect or no so that uh, from the software you uh, from the computer you are able to do the test print this test print after do this test print only connect this uh, printer with the uh, your uh, Rendec POS billing software then there is no issues basically so I'll just open the Rendec POS billing software go to sale panel and in the top your uh, build template is there and the printer settings you can see over here printer settings here see the printer settings and click on that and uh, sell, uh, drop uh, drop down here uh, which uh, printer you are using just to select that select that printer and it is a thermal printer actually you have to select uh, thermal printer uh, here the thermal printer and if you are using cash drawer you can enable this button cash drawer if you are not using cash drawer you can uh, disable that one just save this there should be only one and only printer like this properly it should be perfectly it should be there just to close it close it and now what we will do we will do one template also that I did not show you I will show you again go to build template again there is a thermal printer is there there is so many templates we have uh, we already made the 3 inch uh, 3 inch mini 3 in 2 inches also three, uh, new, different different yani the last one is made this one the 3 inch this is uh, I made for some uh, some of our customer the customized one I will show you that one just uh, close it select any product like that and uh, it is uh, plus GST it is you know add and uh, he paid 171 rupees just save and print then the bill should come over here see this one the proper invoices is came over here 171 rupees there is a GST is there that's a total 171 okay now again I will make one more bill two three items we will add it and we will will it two three items we will add one by one add it and here 856 for example the customer is paid thousand rupees just save and print so immediately we will get the print out over here the beautiful one and one important thing when the number of items is increasing automatically the page number will go down so it will be very you know um, comfortable uh, for you if for example 80 60 100 200 products are there the bill length is automatically will increase this is the uh, basic setting for uh, you know ATMM thermal printer important information so I want to give you about thermal printers there is so many brands thermal printer is available in the market but if you are purchasing a Rindec POS billing software um, there is some special brand is there some, like um, some uh, 3000 rupees 2000 rupees ATMM thermal printers are there that is okay but before you buying that those uh, printers in the Amazon very cheap printers just call us or just call a Rindec uh, customer care service they will guide you they will consult you we uh, experienced a lot of printers even in amazon also what are the printers is there we are buying it and we are testing it in our uh, office so each and every printers experience uh, you can get from Rindec uh, software limited we have a uh, you know we are uh, purchasing all those printers and we are experiencing one by one and uh, when we are going to purchase a tvs uh, thermal printer please consult us before uh, purchasing there is some special models you need to purchase you know this is the thing so TVS um, uh, label printers uh, LP 46 Neo we tested last time there is no issues that is not uh, 
uh, only you know autocad thermal printer it is a multi function printer actually and you can print the barcode everything and the receipt everything lp46 neo that is a good printer actually so if you are purchasing uh, any other uh, you know thermal printer and if you are using Rindec POS billing software, our customer care is ready with you. And they will consult you, they will guide you which printer need to be purchased. And we can give you the link also which one you need to purchase. This is uh, not for getting uh, us a commission or we are not promoting any brand. Basically, it is a, uh, we are, uh, you, uh, we are uh, you know, focusing the customer comfort and the long life and the spare parts availability and the print quality. This is only what we are looking for. Which uh, there is thousands of printers available in the market now, but we are uh, preferring uh, some some number of printers. It will be very easy to do the setup, and you can do yourself. See this uh, printer settings now I have done. That's that much only. That much simplicity is there in some uh, printer uh, manufacturers. Those printers I can help you uh, while you are purchasing any thermal printer. Thank you so much for watching this video. Thank you. Bye bye.